As the morning sun rises over Doral Community Park in Miami, number one prospect, Glaber Torres, heads to the field for his off-season agility training. Glaber traded in the middle of the season from the Cubs to the Yankees. How wild was that last part of the season for you? I had a feeling that I would be traded because of the rumors, but I did not know I was going to the Yankees. When I heard it would be the Yankees, it was pretty emotional. The Yankees have a lot of tradition. They're the team with the most championships in baseball. I think every ball player wants to wear the Yankees jersey. I will take pride in representing the Yankees. What is it about the Yankees that makes you feel pride? Tradition more than anything. I think it will be a very beautiful experience. I am super emotional to represent the Yankees, the tradition of Derek Jeter and the legacy he left. I feel honored to continue that legacy. One of the goals I have is to give everything I have to help the Yankees win a World Series. After the morning training session, Glaber heads to Florida International University to take BP and fielding drills alongside the Venezuelan national team. Who did you look up to when you were growing up? Who was your favorite player? I've watched Mariano Rivera a lot. Also, Derek Jeter. He plays the same position. All the ball players like Derek Jeter. I felt very emotional when they traded for me because I'll be playing the same position. I am motivated to keep working hard. And Omar Vizquel. He plays the same position and is a fellow Venezuelan. You mentioned Omar Vizquel. Kind of ironic. World Baseball Classic right around the corner. Team Venezuela here. You and Omar had a little conversation on the field. What did you say to him? What did he say to you? He's watched me train over here. He told me I have great hands. He thinks I look a little pressured and said it's just a matter of time that I learn how to deal with it. He was happy to see me. I'm happy that he's helping me out and giving me advice. Who do you think is the most influential person in your baseball career so far? My father. My parents. They've helped me with everything since the beginning when I was in Little League. Their guidance has been very important to me. Over the past year, Glaber has been gaining attention after being named MVP of the Arizona Fall League. He also earned himself a trip to big league spring training for the first time in his career. Arizona Fall League, you were the youngest player, wound up winning the MVP in that league. What made it so easy for you? Okay. Training before the games has been a big part of my success. Preparation is the most important thing to me. Before every game, I prepare myself physically and mentally. That has been a major key to my success. You're invited to big league camp for the first time in your career. Did your agent call you? Did the Yankees call you? How did you find out you were heading there? My agent called me to tell me that I had been invited to spring training. He congratulated me. The team called me the next day to congratulate me as well. It was a beautiful experience and I was very emotional. You're the number one prospect in the Yankees organization. You're in the top five as far as Major League Baseball is concerned. Do you feel like there's extra pressure because there are a lot of eyes on you and people are expecting big things from you? I don't feel pressure. I feel very proud to be on those lists. I'm going to keep working hard and giving you my best offer. I want to make my family and my country proud and represent the Yankees the right way. You've only been with the organization for a short while, but it is very youth-driven right now. Does that excite you, knowing that there could potentially be opportunity at the big league level and be opportunity soon? Yes. The Yankees have been giving a lot of young players opportunities. Seeing that inspires me to continue working hard to see if my opportunity comes up soon. What would you like to see happen, as far as your career is concerned, in 2017? I want to keep working hard, give everything I got, also to keep learning. You learn every day and that's very important. 